Harry shocked many this week after announcing he was writing a set of memoirs to be published in late 2022. Describing the project, he said he will write the book not as the prince I was born, but as the man I have become. The global deal for his literary memoir has been acquired by Penguin Random House, with proceeds going to charity. Just one in a string of private enterprises Harry has embarked on since leaving the royal family, the memoirs are set to cast yet more light on his time in the royal family, promising secrets and behind-closed-doors insights. Back home, the firm is unlikely to be pleased, with many, like Prince William, previously voicing concerns that Harry would cash in even further on his royal prestige, according to reports. Meghan and Harry fell out with the royals in 2020 when they left the UK for North America, this year officially casting themselves free of senior royal duties. Tensions were visible even before Megshi, however, especially between Harry and William, the two brothers, in the 36-year-old's words, being on different paths. Yet, looking at archive reports, it appears William isnt the only one to have been in Harry's bad books. According to Vicky Ward, writing in Vanity Fair in 2008, Harry was not all that keen on a young Kate who was slowly entering the royal fold. Added to this, she claimed that the Windsors did little in the way of easing her into their world. Ms. Ward wrote, All the royal press, and former courtiers I spoke to, agreed that until Prince William formalises their relationship Middleton is in an awkward spot. She is not officially entitled to any royal benefits paid for by the taxpayers, such as security, she has no spokesperson and is not receiving any official guidance on what to wear or how to conduct herself in royal circles. However, Ms. Ward said that Kate had taken it on herself to forge bonds with those family members closest to William. She continued, she went to dinner several times with the Queen, who liked her, as did Charles and Camilla. Harry, according to one friend, took longer to warm up to her. However, Harry did eventually strike a strong relationship with Kate, the two enjoying a good friendship. William's friends, the Gloss Posse, were less sure, according to Ms. Ward. She noted, there are those in the Glossy Posse who question whether Middleton's poise is natural. One likened her and her younger sister, Pippa, to the Bouvier sisters, with their obvious desire to marry well. Of course, Kate slotted perfectly into the royal fold. She is the future queen consort, in recent years having taken on more royals in preparation for the top job. Although she has no royal blood, she will still be crowned. Her ceremony will be far smaller than William's, however.